ashes to ashes, we will all fall down. Okay, what's up guys? Welcome back to Ashes to Ashes Paranormal. If you're new here, welcome. Hope you like what you see. Um, today we're at a house, uh, not really sure anything about it. Um, but it's been on our bucket list for a while, and we finally made it. We're about an hour from home. Um, also, guys, today we are actually hitting two houses. This one and another one that also we've been looking for, and I finally found it by mistake the other day. And uh, I've been waiting to get into that. All we know about that is the doctor used to live there. But uh, we're hitting that one from here. And uh, so we got a, two videos we're going to pump out to you soon one after this and we got a couple of locations after that we had already set up so yeah good things to come so anyway guys i hope everybody's been safe sound and let's get to this no it's one thing on the loose too there is a a uh, actually like an outside you see around back there's like a way under the house yeah. but it doesn't look like anything's been coming out Have a look over here. And guys, Chris is taking pictures this time too. So, ooh, mm. um, we will post those. So head over to Instagram, follow us on there, and Facebook, and you'll see some pictures that you guys can look through and tell us if you see anything. Please and thank you. It's an old Everything is old, old, old. The fridge. A little rusty. We didn't move in that front room. It's like, I don't know, it's different yeah it seems claustrophobic to me you know that feeling that you get when you uh, you feel like you're sick but you're like not throwing up it's like yeah. you feel it's just something's off with you for the day and it's like okay a little nauseated yeah, but not to the point that you're gonna kind of rest <clears throat> Also, guys, today we actually I could not find uh, my tablet anywhere with our apps. So today's going to be mainly uh, just raw sound what we hear. When you start the investigation, we'll just sit and listen. I haven't been on this side, but I'm pretty sure. Uh huh. This is a still picture. <laughs> and the still picture, guys, is flicking. in the creepy room. There's this Winnipeg twenty seventeen. Yeah. 
feels like you're walking into another dimension here. You said this room was squishy looking? Listen to one of the steps. Go up. It's like right there. It says right here between the four holes and the base board. Right there in the corner. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Spider there, too. Yay. Actually. Upstairs is going to be creepy as hell. I'll go up and uh, test the waters up there. I'll try these steps out first. Okay. Oh, they're pretty solid, Chris. Not even a shake to them. Anybody up here? What? Yeah. The other one's over the front door. There's mattresses up here, but oh, yeah. it's solid, Chris. Yeah. Looks bigger up here than it does downstairs. Whole place is pretty solid. There's some, some scattered. Yeah. I can understand why being here would be all cushioned. And yeah. I'm going to bang my foot just to see if anything runs. <laughs> is there anybody here that's been uh, still here from when it's been lived in is there somebody still living in here Here the penguins go. <laughs>
Um, I'm going to take a second, guys, to address a comment I got um, on our last video when uh, we had, we're using the Simon toy, which I forgot out in the car. Uh, someone thought they had seen on the package that it said no batteries included. And I had let you guys know that we hadn't taken it out of the package yet because we want you guys to know that it was tampered with. But he, saw, he thought he'd seen on the box that said no batteries included. Well, I had I even thought, well, if that's true, how the hell did I get it? So I actually went and looked at it. I pulled it out that night, and it did include batteries, included test batteries. Um, he read it wrong, which is fine on camera when it's fast, you wouldn't see it, but it does include test batteries, and those are the batteries that are still in it. I still haven't opened the package on Simon yet to put new batteries in, and I won't until those test batteries that it comes with dies. So I just wanted to clear that up if that guy's watching. Um, that's what it was. So would anybody here, if there's anybody here, could you give us a sign that you're here? My name's Dave, that's my brother Chris. What's yours? We'd like to believe that someone's still staying here. This is a beautiful home. Or was at one time, still could be. Or maybe you don't want us here and you can let us know that too. By giving us a big sign, a bang, or throw something. But if you like to, if you'd like to talk, we're not gonna be here very long. Right here. Yeah, I don't like this. It actually feels like I'm standing in a uh, funnel, like I'm going to go towards the center. Yeah, that's what I'm getting right here. Oh, man. Well, this is now my least favorite room. Yeah, it's right over top of it. That creepy room. Yeah. Is there anyone sitting in that chair? I'm having a hard time seeing you. Would you let us know you're there? Or anywhere in here, actually. This old bike. It's an old uh, antenna in here. Like a really big <laughs> antenna. At any time when we're here, if you guys want to let us know where to go or Tell us to get the hell out one of the two, you let us know anytime. Oh. Oh really? Sounds good to do. I didn't know, guys, Chris had the app on his phone, but it's not. Sounds different than what we were used to. Someone give us a sign that we're not the only ones here. Or holler really loud. And I like to see someone throw something. That would let me know that some somebody was somebody else is here with us. Something gets moved or thrown. If you're happy, let us know. If you're pissed off, let us know.
took any in that room yet? Which one? This one? Yeah. solid like there's no this is the odd board that makes a squeak but so we're gonna leave soon guys if uh, there's anybody else here that would like to say hi or bye something okay. Where am I looking? Right here. Mm. They can't say it's a blur because that book's perfect. This book's perfect. The stand's not blurry. Mm. The chair's not blurry. This Just is. Down. And where was that? Right here. Under the table. Yeah. I knew something didn't feel right here. And my camera is on. <laughs> and it's dead. You kidding me? That's full battery again. Huh. Okay, so kind of know that there's somebody here. So you don't have to hide. Yeah, well. Can you be distinctive and let us know you're here? Is that one nothing? Yep. Okay. I wonder how dark it is here. And if I hit night vision, I wonder if something will come through. And So now that we don't have the big bright light in your face, could you uh, maybe show us where you're at? pretty much know there's someone in this room so it's okay to come out and show us still getting that funnel feeling like I'm gonna slide to the center of the room okay well we're gonna head back downstairs and if you want to want us to come back up or let us know you're here you go right ahead and we'll come back
joke or something here. Doesn't we feel too unfriendly yeah. most of the house. Guys, in our next location that we hit after this, I will uh, take Simon in, see if we can get a, a hit on that. See if anything wants to play with it. See the. Uh, I don't know if you can see on the camera. But the house has begun to sunk there in the center. Has begun to yeah sunk sink yeah whatever. This room, this floor, one bit. This other side. Just leads back to the stairs. Kind of keep it to itself. Like, yeah. No real bad feelings other than that nausea. Yeah, but nausea yeah, I think around. something might have happened here. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's still here because it's that and the room above it. So I'm just going to wonder. Yeah, I don't want to see him falling. So the rest of the house doesn't really feel that bad. We were just talking about, but. This room behind me and the one directly above it where that old furnace or stove was feels claustrophobic almost or like a funnel. Chris was feeling upset. So something might have happened here. Let me get that light on. Something might have happened here. I'm going to try to find out if there was any history to this place. Uh, something might have happened like in this area. They're down here, up here. It's the only spot you get really any weird feeling. And it's not a fun one either. Every single time. Hear that? Yeah, like, yeah. Like. We're about to leave if anybody would like to uh, bid us a farewell. Okay guys, this is going to be a short one. So we're going to head to that second location and hopefully that will be up. Um, not too long after you guys are watching this one. So we'll see you in a minute. Okay guys, so we are going to take off um, and head to that second location. Uh, it's a little closer, it's on our way to home. And it's uh, it's different. You'll see when the next, when the next video goes up. Um, I've been hinting towards this uh, video of when me and my wife stayed at a cabin um, that's still going to be done it's just we're in the maritimes here and the weather's been up and down up and down so the, the path there either full of snow or it's mucky and it's full of snow again and it rains so we're just trying to pick the right time to do it even though i'm a little hesitant on going back to that spot 
we're going back because I have to, I'm hoping to find out exactly what it was that we uh, encountered there. But anyway, guys, we will see you on the next one. Good job.